Hi, I'm Ben Russell-Smith, founder and managing director here at Laser Lamps. Today, I'm going to introduce to you the Carbon Series. So people might wonder what goes into the development of a product like Carbon Series. Well, one of my best experiences on developing this product was actually sitting in the passenger seat next to one of the Emersport World Rally Championship drivers. And as he's driving around the forest lanes, he's pointing to the dark spots. And let me tell you, that is quite an experience. With that kind of feedback and this kind of driver input, we were able to perfect the beam pattern and really understand the needs of those drivers. Because when you're driving around a um, forest stage or through snowy conditions and you come against a wall of snow ice, as they call it, or ice fog, that's where you need the kind of technical advances that we've put into these products. The Carbon Series Gen 1, it had original carbon fiber lamp body and shell. It had that increased distance and it had that lightweight. Over the years since then, we've seen more and more different types of race customers adopt the product. And in that time as well, we've brought out advances and improvements in the product to make sure that we stay at the very front of motorsport lighting. So one of the key bits of feedback that we had from the race drivers was the need in foggy conditions or rainy conditions to be able to change the beam pattern to give them more visibility on the road and less glare. In case the conditions are particularly bad, you can also operate a reduced output mode. So you can drop the beam pattern, but still run at 100%, or you can drop the beam pattern and run at just 25%. So in terms of lumen output, the Carbon 6 has got a 7,800 uh, lumen output. Carbon 4, we're looking at 6,240 lumens. And the Carbon 2, we're at 3,100 lumens. All of our Carbon Series lights come in two different beam patterns. We've got the spot beam pattern, which is giving huge long distance performance and actually still a little bit of width on that long range spot. We've also got a drive beam pattern, which is a much wider beam pattern. So with the drive, we're achieving 60 degrees of left right spread uh, and about 15 degrees in up down spread. While the spot, we've got 32 degrees uh, of width and we've got a slightly tighter 12 degrees up down spread. So in Europe, it's important in some race series for the lights to be E marked. And so the Carbon 6 has got a reference of 37.5 when it's with the spot beam pattern. And it's got a reference of 12.5 when we've got the drive beam pattern. So when you are on a race stage and it's a closed road, you can up the light output from 25% up to 100%. But when you're driving back on a public road between stages, you should enter this road legal reduced power mode. Now, interestingly, in terms of power consumption, we've been careful with the Carbon 6 in particular to stay within certain restrictions of a lot of race car power control modules. So actually with the Carbon 6, we're drawing 5.9 amps of power at 14 volts, but we've got something called active power management on this product. And what is that doing? Well, if the voltage is getting low, so let's say the engine is off and the alternator isn't running, due to the restrictions of certain power control modules on the vehicle, we don't wanna go above 7.1 amp of current consumption and it ensures that actually, even when the engine isn't running, you're not gonna have very high current draw. All of the carbon lights feature a inbuilt four pin Deutsch connector, which means that you've got two for power and then you're able to control the move to low beam or fog with voltage being applied to the third pin. And then there's also a fourth pin, which allows you to control the switch to reduced intensity. So in terms of 
fixing the lamps to the vehicle. The Carbon 6 is featuring side fixings only. The Carbon 2 and the Carbon 4 also feature the same side mounting solution, but we do additionally have a front fix solution on both the Carbon 2 and the Carbon 4. So this was really developed with motorsport teams feedback in mind. So quite often from an ease of adjustment point of view, the race team would want to be able to turn a screw from outside the vehicle and adjust the lamp in an outboard or inboard or up down direction. And actually the only way to do that in a fast and effective way is to change the fixing from being side mount to being front fix. In terms of the weight of the product, so the Carbon 2, we're looking at a weight of 230 grams thereabouts. The Carbon 4, we've got a weight of 350 grams, uh, more or less, and the Carbon 6, 450 grams. So the Carbon series also come with a range of lens covers as pictured here. The black lens cover would be used so that you're keeping the lamp completely clean so that when you get onto your night stage, you can whip the cover off and you've got a clear lens and you can then see with maximum performance. In case the fog or the snow is getting particularly bad, there is a yellow lens cover and this clips onto the front of the lamp, avoiding the need for having external clips going around the product it enables the lamp to be fully embedded in a bumper fascia or a rally pod without the need for having additional cutout areas to allow for the clips. So as described, four modes uh, are coming as standard on these lamps, but it is important to say that the Carbon 4 and the Carbon 6 do also feature a PWM function. So that's a pulse width modulation function and it would enable a race team to tune the beam pattern coming out of these products to however they would like. So in terms of the color of light coming from these lamps, so we're using a high color rendering index LED. So color rendering index is essentially the quality of light that you're getting when you're driving. And I know how important this is at the top end of motorsport. And in fact, I remember being in a Swedish rally on a test drive with one of M Sports drivers and them highlighting the importance as they compared this to their previous lamp technology and they were delighted by the increase in contrast they had from our products compared with the previous generation of, of lighting solution. Additionally, they're at the natural daylight end of the spectrum, so they're 5000 Kelvin color temperature. They all come with a five year warranty and we ensure that the quality is at the top end with a very extensive testing program that happens not just here at our factory, but also in conjunction with some of our customers in real world situations. So I hope this video gives you a bit more of an explanation about the Carbon Series. Please do get in touch with us if you need any more information or you've got any uh, technical questions. We'd be delighted to hear from you. Until then, see you next time.